Hey guys, Johnny here. Oh, this isn't focus. Oh, hey guys, Johnny here. I just came back from a grueling ride. Um, from well, we went to Miami, Toronto. Uh, um, we went to Niagara Falls, Philadelphia, which I did make a Rocky video. Um, and a whole bunch of other places we went to. And um, I have a very big haul today. My, is my vacation 2013 haul. Yes, I have more, I, I spent oh, like over $100 on this, so yeah. Uh, first thing, I won this at a claw machine. It's a neck pillow. I needed one of these badly, even though it's a girlish one, but still, I needed one of these. And I bought so much Rocky stuff that I needed to move some stuff. Move the shelf. I got this at West Virginia. There's some fuzzy dice. Oh, whoa. The West Virginia logo. You know, Geno Smith just came out of there, so he was a top draft prospect. So you just hang him up on your car and something like that. I won this at a claw machine. It's a nerd monkey gorilla pillow. Um, I also won this in a claw machine. Um, little ice cream cone. Green and... I mean, blue and yellow. I mean, pink. Oh, well, yellow the cone. And it has arms. I also got this. Where's the other one? This bird. Yeah. I also wanted a claw machine. All those were at the same claw machine, so I like emptied it out, kind of. Um, this I got at um, I think it was Pittsburgh. I'm not sure, but it was like in Pennsylvania. It's a Pittsburgh Steelers mini that I wore in my Rocky video. So yeah. I got this at um, I think it was Virginia. It's a Patriots little T.Y. beanie thing. It's like a little ball. And it's got like big old eyes. And um, yeah, it's actually licensed by NFL. So yeah, you could throw it and all that stuff. And it's got beans on the bottom, so it always lands on its feet. Um, next thing I got was in Niagara Falls. You know how the Canadians always love their hockey. I got a Canadian Niagara Falls hockey puck. And it's very heavy. So yeah, that's another thing. I got this Niagara Falls, Canada football. It's like a little plush football. So yeah. Um, let's see. I think the rest is all Philadelphia. Oh, I got this. It was a little brochure, but it's a poster in Toronto. It's like a little Frankenstein poster. It's actually a brochure, but it's... okay. There's a couple more stuff here from uh, Virginia. I got a ton of mini helmets because there's a mini helmet machine. I needed these for a video. There's a lot of them, and I gotta fix them because the the uh, face thing is kind of loose. Um, first of all, I won this at a claw. It's running the edge. It's a bottle holder for West Virginia. That'll go good along with my dice. Um, I got this uh, the first mini helmet, a Chargers one. There's San, San Diego Chargers. New England Patriots, which we just got Tivo, but he won't replace Tom Brady, I know that. That's basically, and the, the head pieces are kind of weak, so I have to, I have to super glue them. Vikings. Minnesota Vikings. Another Chargers. Uh, Saints. Well, in Saints. I actually have a, a Riddle Pocket Pro. So this actually counts as a double, but I also have a Riddle Pocket Pro, the Super Bowl version. But this is just the plain one, so yeah. It's just the normal team helmet. And the last one, the Dallas Cowboys. America's team. Or like America's joke now, but America's team. Back in the day. Once upon a time, America's team, but now they're America's joke. Now I got this. Now the rest we have is from Philadelphia. Well, except this. These I got. Um, these two are pretty epic. Um, I picked one up for thirty and another one for ten. This I picked up for thirty. A Steve Young authentic worn jersey card. Um, it's one. It's eighty-eight of one twenty-five. So barely any of these were made, and it's authentic. I picked it up for 30 bucks. Well, he gave it to me for 20. I got it at Charleston in the city market. And um, 
I got this one for 10. It's Teddy Bruski, so it came with the, like 32 something. And it's an, it's another game worn jersey. And this one's not limited, so yeah. This I got in Niagara Falls is a camera. It's for my WWE figures for the football video, you know, to have a cameraman. Yeah. Uh, let's see if I can get it on here. Alright, wait, is finger supposed to go in here? I don't know. I don't know. I'll, I'll find a way. But it's basically a camera for our figures and it shows photos from the falls and all that stuff. Um, the rest now is from Philadelphia. Uh, and it is huge. I got this for my, for my grandfather for his, for Father's Day. It's actually a little hat, but on the bottom it's a bottle opener. So he's, when he's watching a baseball game, all he does is like, there it is. It's actually a pretty good gift. I think he'll like it. Okay, now the rest, um, I spent over a hundred dollars on everything that you see here. Uh, but they're actually pretty cool. I, what, actually I got this in Toronto, uh, right next to the Rogers Center and, and next to CNN, CN Tower. This guy actually painted like a, a portrait of Tom Brady, which is awesome. There he has like, he even got the 50 Seasons logo right. And uh, it says 12 quarterback Tom Brady. He's going like, yes. He's screaming and there he's just passing the ball and there he's just carrying the ball. And it's impressive. I like it. So I picked it up. It was like, I think 20 or 10, I think it was like 20, 10 bucks, something like that. But it was pretty good. And I'm definitely going to frame this. I have a lot of photos and artworks in here. That I picked up here. Um, uh, brochure. Um, this. Uh, I don't know what that is. I got this at the top of the steps. Is the hat that I wore for the Rocky video. I, I actually got it when I completed my run up the steps. The second time. Because I saw the guy the first, the first run. And then the second run I went back up to get it. So my Rocky hat. I actually got this. I got this for free. They gave it to me at Laurel Hill Cemetery for free. It's a little vintage Rocky doll, which is very rare, and I really want that figure, or plush toy, but it's very rare and it's very expensive. Um, and it's right next to Adrian's grave, and notice that's when it was next, what, right when it was like, that's when it was in the location that it was in the film, so yeah, that's a little postcard. They get it me for free. This, I've been looking for this everywhere, and I got it because it so reminds me of Punch-Out!, and I think it will to you guys too. Oh, by the way, the Heat won the, the world championship. Yeah. Representing. Back to back. I'm going to the parade on Monday with Pedro. I'll probably make a video of that. It's reverse punch out. It's, so just, it's Rocky pulling on the bike with Mickey on it. And I was looking through, like, I think it was called Philly Graphics. The store was called, and I was looking for this, and then, like, I was looking for, like, a bunch of photos, and I found this one. And there, I have not found this photo in years. I'm looking for it so long, and I still haven't found it. Look where I found it. Let me read you what it says down here. His trainer, Mickey Burgess Meredith, goes along for the ride as Rocky Sylvester Stallone trains for the championship match in Rocky Three, released in the United States and Canada by MGM. Blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, it's like reverse punch out, if you think about it. And it's just a great photo. I'm going to frame it. I got this at the same store that I got that photo. It's a Rocky photo. It's, uh, this is awesome. I, I love this photo. This is awesome. And they have hidden quotes on here, but it's hard to read because of the, the, the font. It's like this dirt font. But I see one over here says, Do I know how to drive? I'm one of the greatest. I'll drive airplanes and bulldozers. I'll drive you crazy if you give me a chance. And that's from Rocky 2 when they bought the car. And this, this is the photo from Rocky 3. And it has Rocky all over it. And I think it says down here, Italian Stallion. And a uh, very awesome photo. It's going to be great when I put it on the frame. It's just awesome. Sorry about the glare. They're still covered. I still haven't opened them. Um, this, uh, well, I got this at the top of the steps along with the hat. It's a Rocky shirt. It says, oops, Philadelphia Rocky. And just has him, um, like, putting his arms up in the art museum on top of the steps. Um, I actually got big, oh, I got a few stuff here. I got two cards from Victor Cafe. There they are. Um, this is actually, I actually got a few stuff here. Um, yes, 
That's it. Um, this, I got this little magnet along with something else that I have on there. It's like a little magnet. It's got Rocky on it. And I also got this. It's a magnet of the statue. And it has like the 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 uh, ring design from the first movie. And let me read you what it says. The same thing says on this postcard. And I'm going to read you what it says on the postcard. Rocky, the character who represents the courageous spirit of the great city of Philadelphia and the brotherhood of its people. Thunder in his heart. A Thomas Schumberg sculpture. Sculptor. I don't know. Sculpture. Yeah. That's what the uh, sculpture is called. And that's when it was in the spectrum. That wasn't when it was in the art museum. And I actually like this. I think I'm going to frame it too. And this says the same thing except it says Philadelphia on the top. Where is it? There it is. And it has a different design, but it's a magnet. I actually got this at the Italian market. Um, no, it is not food. It's actually something else. That I They sell all kinds of stuff there. I love it. I got this. You're probably asking yourself, John, I thought you hated Barcelona. Yeah, I do hate Barcelona, but I don't hate this guy. That's right. I, ha I finally got a Leo Messi jersey. I've been looking for this shit everywhere, and it's cost expensive as hell. I got this one for 35 Not that bad. And it's awesome. It's very comfortable. So, yeah. Um, these last two items were actually... Believe it or not, th this is the entire set that I have here. It's They're called I Philosophies, and I even looked it up. This is the entire set. Um, it has two quotes from um, two Rocky movies. This is from Rocky 3. It's when he's talking to Adrian. He goes, nothing is real if you don't believe in who you are. And, yeah, it has a photo from Rocky 2. All of them have a photo from Rocky 2. Well, the other one that I have has a photo from Rocky 2. And the same store had the other two. I got this one for 8 and the other one for 12. And they're called I Philosophies. And by Culture... Culture... Culture Nick. Culture Nick. It's a 16 by 16. So, yeah, very expensive framing I have to get for these. And this one is an even bigger frame. It's kind of bent here. It's kind of bent. I don't want to bend it even more. It was, it was kind of like this, except this part. It's like bent like that. But I'll put it in a frame, so that's okay. This is a quote from Rocky IV when he's talking with his son. It says, going in one more round when you, don't, when you don't think you can is what makes a difference in your life. So, yeah. And my dog is outside. What, ran outside. So, yeah, this is a quote from Rocky IV. So, yeah. Oh, no, he went in. Okay. So, yeah, this is a quote from Rocky IV when he's talking to his son. And there's a photo from Rocky too. And they're actually licensed by MGM, so yeah. That says, going in one more round when you don't think you can, that's what makes a difference. That's what makes all the difference in your life, and that's Rocky. And it has a hole right here, yeah, I gotta take this out of the packaging already. Um, yeah, I'm just like making it bigger so I can take this out. And yeah, this is a, uh, I don't know how big this is. Let me check in the back. Uh, it doesn't even say, so yeah, it's gonna be a pain. And I'm gonna take it out here, just... Because it has this ginormous hole on it. It was kind of bent when I bought it. Because they had it in like some rack. That it didn't fit. Come on. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of bent. Right there. It's got like a crease. Because it didn't fit in the car. But yeah. You can basically see it. There it is. So I gotta find a frame for this thing. And thanks for watching my haul. Be sure to also watch my Rocky uh, Philadelphia story. Or my my Rocky story. Going the distance. That's what the video is called. Because really, it's also a triumph for me. Because we have 50 subscribers already. And over 200 videos. And that was basically a triumph for me. Because I finally got to live my dream of, Rocky, of going up the Rocky steps. And putting my arms up just like Stallone. And it was also a triumph for us, the, the 100 x 619 channel, because we we were at the bottom in 2011, and now we're at the top. Uh, well, we're, we reached over 50 subscribers, we're about to reach 100, and uh, that's a, a huge honor for me. So, thank you guys for watching this haul, and I'm also going to have an unboxing video now, because I just received a package my neighbor has been holding on my mail. And, uh, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching and be sure to watch my Rocky video. Link is in the description. And also the behind the scenes is also in the description. Thank you.